The Galaxy Z Fold 4 and the Galaxy Z Flip 4 are going to be the next flagship foldables from Samsung, where the Fold 4 is rumored to sport some significant changes while the Flip 4, with some small upgrades furthermore talking about the changes the Z Fold 4 easily wins over the Z Flip 4, with tons of new upgrades first being the built-in S Pen support, which was much needed feature for the device with bigger screen real estate. Next is the new ultra-thin glass, which is rumored to be tougher and higher in quality than any other glass used on the Samsung foldables. Last but not the least are the overhaul of the camera design under display camera slimmer body and smaller hinge, for that extra clean look. However the Z Flip 4 on the other hand according to the leaker Perfect is rumored to be very similar to its predecessor, though it is claimed to have a slight increase of 10-20% to 20 battery capacity and just over 2 inches of outer screen than the current model moreover the same source also claims about the triple camera setup. In the Flip 3, though the quality isn't expected to be anywhere near to the Galaxy Z Fold 4. Having said that these few possible upgrades for the Z Flip 4 sound exceedingly small and are likely to have much less of an impact than the changes we might be seeing with the Galaxy Z Fold 4 though remember all these are just rumors and nothing has been officially confirmed. However if you ask me it would have been nice to see all sorts of fancy upgrades in the Z Flip 4, but a relatively small upgrade might be more sensible approach which might allow Samsung to push the price down even lower, or at least keep it around the level of the current model for more affordable and accessible entry point to foldable phones nevertheless. The Z Fold 4 with its likely greater upgrades is sure to be expensive but it could make for an exciting option for those who want a cutting-edge foldable and are prepared to pay for it. Either way that's pretty much it for this review, thank you so much for watching. Beside only a small percentage of people who watch my videos are actually subscribed. So if you eventually love this video please consider subscribing and you can always change your mind as always see you in the next video.